You know what else I have been playing, though? Yeah. Unless you want to keep talking. No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Go for it. Okay. What I've been really addicted to in just, you know, on the shitter or at work when I have free time or on my lunch break or right before going to bed. Dude, fucking Marvel Snap. Marvel Snap oh, yeah. on mobile. Oh, it's so good. I'm I can't. A, I'm I can't fully stop, in on that dude. too. I can't stop. It's so good. It's like there's a couple of aspects I wish were better, yeah. but it, it just keeps me coming back, man. I haven't spent any money on it, and I don't think I will. Um, but I've I've done all the challenges for the whole week, for all of the season, for every day. I've beaten all the challenges. And man, it's so good. It's like if Gwent uh, met like this Magic the Gathering game, an old an old uh, way to play was called Plane Chase, where you had cards, which are essentially locations that they would change the game, the tide of the game. So it'd be like all creatures have this and it, it's it's like that. But you get three different things and they stay the same for the most part, throughout the game. It's fantastic. It's quick six-round games that only last maybe 10 minutes. If and that, yeah. Yeah, if that. Um, it's fun. The art's really good. Um, there, There's pretty good incentives also. Like, unlocking cards is really rewarding, um, albeit random. Kind of wish you could choose some cards, but it kind of makes you play outside of your comfort zone a little bit because you'll get a card and you're like, oh, I kind of want to use that. Doesn't fit in my deck, but, you know, I'll put it, I'll make a new one and I'll put it here. I love it. Yeah, that's that's been the exciting thing about it is just like when I've got some downtime, I'll I'll get in there and I'll, you know, s- yeah. see what I can do. I'll, if I have a little more time, I'll go in and I'll like adjust a deck or make a new deck. I have a deck called yep. like strong boys, which is just <laughs> all my strong cards or, nice. uh, my ongoing cards. Cause one of the challenges was do all the ongoing. So I just put all these cards with ongoing mm-hmm. effects. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, it's really cool. And I hope like, uh, throughout time they continue to like keep adding the like lands, you know, like you were saying, oh, yeah. Like you were saying before, uh, there's like three slots where you can play, um, and they're called like different locations, like different locations. That's, that's the word I'm looking for. They're different locations and each location has different effect on your cards and your cards can be stronger or weaker than your cards. And you know, it's, it's kind of like, uh, yeah, it's like magic, but like really, really fucking simplified and really fucking simplified. Um, yeah. And fast. And very fast, super fast. Like I, I was telling you yesterday, like I got stuck at a train, right? Uh, mm-hmm. And a train was passing by. I, it was one of those long ass trains. So mm-hmm. I just put my car in the park. <laughs> 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 I played a match of Marvel Snap. And by the time it was done, the train was almost gone. That's and fantastic. Then I uh, went on my way. It was great. And that's the, that's, that's the best part of the game is just like, it's so easy to just play a game real quick. Like I, I yeah. like, I took my mom to the doctor today and um, I just played a couple matches of Marvel snap, you know, while I was waiting, like it was, it was great. It's it's beautiful, man. It's a beautiful game. Perfect for mobile. This is the kinds of games that we need on mobile where you can pick it up, literally play for five minutes and put it down. It is missing uh, a few key features. I would say like PVP. uh, Yeah. Like private, private battles would be nice. Yeah. Um, and a multiplayer could you imagine a 2v2 oh that'd be so cool yeah that'd be cool or like different game modes even would be cool like there, there's one effect that turns a game into a seven turn game mm-hmm. yeah. and that's actually really fun when it gets to seven turns it's like that'd be cool if there were like different game modes where it's like this is a 10 turn game or something you know like yeah. maybe in the future they'll add something like that and i, I hope oh, they I'm keep sure. supporting it like it's it's really cool it's really fun i saw uh a report that said it made like two million dollars in its first week. So oh, think, and it's a free game. So it's I a th- free game, people. Yeah. So I think it's uh doing just fine, and I think we'll see more and more of it to come. It does have those like predatory natures. I think the UI is trash. I hate the UI. Um, oh, the music is awful. Oh, I turned that. Shit oh off. my god, the music is so bad. Yeah. Um, but also there's like a t- almost two hundred different cards. 
Yeah. In the game too. And they're so gonna that's keep kind adding. of impressive. Yeah, they're gonna keep adding. And like I think yeah. in a couple of years, like it's gonna be like a crazy amount of cards. Like so. Yeah. It'll be sweet. Yeah. It'll be really cool. I'm I'm excited for this game. I'm having a blast with it. 